Rockstar is releasing new posts in Rockstar Newswire about the new summer DLC update in GTA Online, which we're going to be going through in this video. However, the ending of this post doesn't look that great as GTA Plus members on PS5 and Xbox Series X and S will receive a new supercar, which is the Overflot PP Strello, as you can see on the screen right here, for free as part of their member benefits on the day that the summer DLC will be released. And if you read closer, Rockstar says a week before it becomes available to all players. Oh boy, I don't think the community will be too happy to hear this. GTA Plus members are not just going to get this super car for free, but they're going to get it way earlier than everyone else supposed to get. And I think this is the first time Rockstar have done this, that they allow content to be accessed earlier behind a paywall. Alright, next Rockstar has released this screenshot on Rockstar Newswire and it appears that we're going to be getting a new business called the Bounty Hunting Business. Rockstar says this summer it's time for some high value target practice to clean up the roving ripper raids of Southern San Andreas with your very own bail enforcement and bounty hunting business. In the next major update for GTA Online, finally we'll be getting a new business which is quite a while and I think this will be the last business that we'll get because next year probably GTA 6 will be released at the end of the year. Also, we got some hints of this bounty hunting business in Rockstar News Warrior. If you read closer, it says, in other words, of Mod Eccles, this world is full of scum and detritus and it's only right that we all bear our share. As we all have known, Mod Eccles have appeared in her first appearance in the official Grand Theft Auto 5 trailer. She is also inside of GTA Online where we're doing the bounty hunting missions. Even in this world full of scum and detritus, it's only right that we all bear our share. So I'm super excited that we're able to work with her again in this summer DLC update. As you can see from the screenshot, we have our own prison, which is really awesome. And look at the new clothing that we're going to get. We're going to be getting this bail enforcement agent vest and also this new kind of like badge that we can wear as a chain. Hope it's something official that we can use from our what robe, not just like the IAA badge that we get from the previous Operation Paper Trail. Alright, next, as usual, we're going to be getting new set of vehicles. Here are some of the showcase that we can see from Rockstar News Warrior. Rockstar says, this summer action-packed GTA Online update also delivers a collection of new rides to collect, boost to payouts across a number of existing modes and missions, including taxi work, open wheel races, operation paper trail, and more. Rockstar also says, stay tuned to the News Warrior for more details on what's headed to GTA Online this summer, including our annual Independence Day celebration, extra bonuses on the Chop Shop, the contract and more. These are the clothing that we're expecting to get in the Independence Day update, which is gonna be early July. And I'm guessing we're gonna be getting the summer DLC end of July or early August. So that's it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. If you find this video useful, be sure to hit the subscribe for more future GTA videos. This is Joe, and I'll see you next time.